All right, guys, day four is rainy and 45. So it's about uh, 9.30. I figured I'd come out a little later. And uh, try to sit for the evening. A lot of people say don't bother hunting the rain. But I have found that the deer still live outside when it's raining out. So it's supposed to stop around noon. So I want to get in there a little bit early. And uh, maybe they're bedding down. See if I can get in early before they start moving around so I don't spook them. And see if we can get something off their cycle. Had a couple more does coming in, but again, not till eight o'clock or so at night. So maybe with this rain, they're gonna be off schedule a little bit. And uh, see what we can come up with. Arianne and Chloe's at the house, so I do have help again today. I, they're waiting for my call. They said that they would like nothing more than on this rainy day and to come out and drag deer, so. I'm just going to try to do what I can to make that wish come true and we'll go from there. So uh, as you guys know, about a 25 minute walk in, let's get in there and see what we can come up with. guys sorry to disappoint you on day four but it was a wet one and then a cold one at about 2 30 a couple guys decided they were gonna four wheel through the woods right behind me and then I heard a gunshot right in front of me so at that point I was wet enough decided to walk out didn't see nothing on my way out was one time I heard uh, some twigs breaking, definitely bigger than the squirrel. So I don't know if it was another hunter or a deer, but didn't see anything after. Tried grunting a little bit. But tomorrow 
is Sunday, and then I work Monday, and then I got the rest of the week off uh, for Thanksgiving. We will go from there, see if we can get on to something. Got to see if I can get you guys some good footage. I'm sure you're getting sick of watching all these videos with no deer, so got to find something for you. Got to find some meat for ice fishing. Or we're going to get stuck eating hot dogs all year again. And I would prefer not to eat hot dogs all year for ice fishing. That's not Sarah's house. She's not home. But, alright. We'll catch up with you guys Tuesday. I'm going to go out in the evening. I got to take Chloe to Portland for her uh, braces appointment in the morning. So hopefully we'll get out. If not, it's Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and that's the end of the 2023 season. So, wish me luck, I guess. Alright guys, it is day five, and it is 1.19 in the afternoon. Chloe and I had to go to Portland this morning for her appointment for her braces. I didn't even think I'd get out at all, but I'm going to go sit for a couple hours. Um, I'm out of breath because I just ran to get everything ready. And I'm overweight and out of shape, so sorry. Um, so after her appointment, we had a little car problems where it took us to the store that we didn't want to go to. So we were there for about an hour. No, so I got a couple hours not really knowing what to expect tonight going in this late um, I do have some of that uh, camo burlap I want to try to hide my seat a little bit and I'm off for the rest of the week so we can hit it hard and tonight might be a waste but you can't shoot them if you're not in the woods so let's go
think if you're going to drive a four-wheeler into public land, you should at least stay until the end. It's the same guys that came in the other day. I sat in the rain all day, and then they came in at 2.30 when it stopped raining. I had heard something just before that. They spooked it off, never came in. signs all the way around it and sit in the middle with a nice food plot. Not a fan of people. It's 4.30 now. I forgot my phone at home, so Chloe's probably mad at me. We'll hop down. Try to find our way out of here in the dark. All right, guys, we're heading out. It's 5.20 in the morning. Legal time, I believe, is like 6.11. 30 degrees, but most importantly, right here, snow. That's what we've been waiting for, not only for ice fishing, but it'll be nice for hunting, too. So let's go get in those woods early, see what we can come up with today. I gotta get you guys a deer. You guys are gonna go find other channels. I've been watching some at night. It's pretty exciting seeing these deer being harvested. So, we gotta get something. <laughs>
this point and end up ruining my cell phone. Not really worth that. It's starting to rain a little harder, so let's head back to the truck. Spend the rest of the day editing this video. All right, guys, nothing on the way out. It's been a frustrating season so far. Um, but that's why they call it deer hunting and not deer shooting, I guess. So I ended the count at 27 gunshots. Several of them were uh, rapid fire, so definitely the same gun. Uh, Four-wheeler went in front of me. Four-wheeler went two times behind me. Because I'm a uh, sportsman and also a male, I'll play that card. You gotta have some sort of excuse as to why you didn't get a deer in the back of your truck on the way home. So those are my excuses, but if you really wanna look at it, glass half full, I mean, I don't read too much into the gunshots and stuff. They can scare deer toward you just as much as they scare them away from you. Um, so it's not a uh, deal breaker if you hear them. Uh, it's just, uh, sometimes it seems ex it's pretty uh, excessive. You know, people shooting repeatedly. I carry two rounds in my gun. I only have the second one just in case I make an air shot and the deer doesn't drop right there if I get a, to track it and shoot it again or whatever which is the right thing to do and not let it suffer and bleed out and run three or four miles so frustrating but that's hunting so unfortunately you guys aren't gonna see a deer in this video but I'll get it edited and get this out for you guys so you can see what I've been up to I don't want you guys to assume I'm sitting on the couch watching Netflix. I'm out in the cold, out in the snow, the rain, and uh, trying to get it done for you guys. It's been a couple years since I have gotten a deer, and honestly, I've been mad about it, you know, both years, but this year having you guys along with me, and I'm going to pull the old dad card. I'm not mad, I'm just disappointed. I would like nothing more than to get something on camera for you guys I've been watching a ton of videos and I really enjoy it but as long as you guys like hanging out with me and try to make it a little bit funny and do what I can to entertain you guys that's all that matters um, not everything is gonna be a success story that's life and I'm fine with it you know I've seen uh, some squirrels doing some funky stuff. I saw that bunny below me this morning. I've had a bird land on the barrel of my gun. And uh, it's still enjoyable for me. Um, as much as I want to get some meat for ice fishing, I'm still having a good time. I'm still enjoying myself. So let's get this edited. Let's get it out to you guys. And I just want to say that I guarantee you heard that correctly. Guarantee you guys will see some deer on the next video. So, if you like what you're seeing, feel free to subscribe to our channel. It's absolutely free. Uh, like I said, I know the end result isn't what we wanted right now, but I'm more than happy to keep trying for you guys. So, feel free to subscribe and hit that like button. Share these videos with your friends, and uh, we'll get back at you tomorrow three more days let's go